And it's one of the memories that I can't say this without crying. Right? <laughs> that I have a your father when he was trying to decide. <laughs> Between a red and a blue, ten cent this watch for you. Was this a part of the um, Eagle Stamps? He bought, was bought with Eagle Stamps. <laughs> <laughs> it was ten cents. We didn't have ten cents. <laughs> but you mean you couldn't? You did, the Eagle Stamps didn't help. Oh yes, we turned the book in. Uh, but we bought several other things. I see. <laughs> but he wanted you to have a wristwatch. <laughs> you got a red one naturally. Yeah, okay, and this was back, um, now is that the same store that I would have called Carp's? Or no. It was a separate store? No, it's an old store. It's the store where my mother went to work when she was 16. Mm -hmm. She was bookkeeper and cashier there. I mean, that's right and she in, was 16 years old. And that's right in downtown Granite City. Yes, but Granite City didn't have much downtown. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, they lived in one of the new 50 bricks, which were the first houses built there. Oh, yes. Uh, mm -hmm. Venice was very well established at that time, but Granite mm -hmm. City was not. Mm -hmm. So that would have been on, on uh, Benton, Del Mar, and Cleveland Streets? No, it was at the um, State Street and 19th, 19th and State Street. Oh yeah, I remember that it was. Yeah, mm -hmm. right there on the corner. Mm -hmm. And it was there for years, because mm -hmm. we shopped there later. Mm -hmm. It was a department store. A department mm -hmm. store. Yeah. So I know that, um, that when uh, money was dear and you had none, there was a time when you had a Christmas tree, but how, how did that work? Uh, how, how did you get the Christmas tree? Well, that was a couple of years later. Um, we didn't have a, uh, a Christmas tree, but we did have a little evergreen growing out in the yard. And Daddy dug it up and put it in a, well, I think at first it was just like a pick basket, small. Mm -hmm. And we used that same tree for three or four years. Every year it got a little bigger. And you'd move it back in and oh, set and then it back out. After Christmas, he set it out again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, uh, but then it got so large, he was afraid it would kill it. Mm -hmm. And we, then we bought trees. Mm -hmm. Well, I remember one Christmas, I can remember this, I don't know how old I was, when you bought some sort of candles and you actually lit the candles. Oh, that was tree. probably when we were very first married, because that's the kind we had when I was a child. Uh, no, but I remember it. <laughs> yeah. It had to be a little oh, further I, along. I probably had some of what were our candle holders at the time. Uh -huh. You know, yes, mm -hmm. we did. Mm -hmm. Well, we didn't have electricity, see. Not until the REA came through. And yes, that, and I was 13 when that happened. Yeah. But I do remember that. Was there ever any real concern or worry about fire? Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You'd light the tree, everybody stood around, and we just stayed right there mm -hmm. and maybe let it burn for 10 or 15 minutes. Then all the candles were put out again. Mm -hmm. Because you never left it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Especially if the tree, as it got older and drier, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, what kind of um, ornaments and preparation did you make for the tree other than digging it up and, and putting it back? Uh, was, there anything, was there anything special about that? Yes, uh, I had a few that were mothers. There was one little wax angel, and you kids would watch for that every Christmas. Mother said that had been on their tree. Mm -hmm. I remember that one in particular, and I had some of hers. And then I soon learned to buy plastic ornaments. <laughs> <laughs> because the others would get broken. Mm -hmm. But we had little plastic reindeers and snowmen and mm -hmm. things like that. Mm -hmm. And they, I'd hang them low on the tree and the breakable ones up high. Mm -hmm. Well then, what happened, uh, um, what kind of fruits or what kinds of things did you put in our Christmas stockings? Uh, what Always was Hershey's Kisses. Hershey's Kisses. We usually could manage those. Mm -hmm. And then I made homemade candy during some of the years when mm -hmm. we didn't have. And little um, coconut uh, pieces that kind of rectangular in shape. 